अरे ये तो रियल लाइफ तेलगी से भी ज्यादा तेलगी लग रहा है यू नो आई वॉज प्लेइंग सुशांत फ्रेंड वी जेल टूगेदर वी वी हैड फन आई मीन इट वॉज नॉट लाइक कोई वन डे और वन इंसिडेंट ओवरऑल फीलिंग वॉज क्वाइट चिल्ड एन यू नो जोक मार रहे हैं खेल रहे हैं uh, थोड़ा से मजाक मस्ती कर रहे हैं द काइंड ऑफ बैक क्लाश दैट द कास्टिंग चॉइस इन सांड की आक रिसीव लार्जली दैट सॉर्ट ऑफ मेड यू very uh, you know conscious about this one that you know i would want somebody who perfectly fits the bill it's a very easy way to say for people on this side of the fence to say that you should have made it mm. i wanted to make with older women i had my cast also with the older women and but no one wanted to put the money in the film so without paise to picture nahi ban sakti even after getting the two heroes it was tough for me to finish that movie in that certain amount of budget right. so it's not easy for a maker you know but in the end i'm happy that my my entire thing was that at the end of this that both my heroines won the best actress award so there's nothing better than that hello everyone welcome to news 18 and today we have with us the solid team of scam 2003 tushar gagan welcome thank you how thank are you, you doing oh uh, at the moment on <laughs> tenter hooks yeah uh, <laughs> big day for us on first yes. for both of us who are unknown to become hopefully known after this so this is what it you is you are quite known both of you chalo if you're saying so yeah you just being modest <laughs> <laughs> no so of course yeah i'm sure like you said you know you're on tenter hooks and i can imagine where it's coming from you know the super success of you know the first one uh scam 92 uh is that something that's sort of bogging you down the pressure that to deliver you know actually no uh, to be honest this is a different story and uh, from day one anshul sir was there with us always he kept holding our hands throughout the show even mm. now he's still with us though he's in london he's still there over here i can feel it so he has been with us and plus uh, sameer sir from applause kept on telling us no pressure i see from studio next in the neel strategy he also was very chilled he was adding the production so there was no pressure as such but yeah we have tried to do, do our best and now we're hoping for the best yeah yeah same for you same for me i mean uh, uh, though it's the same series uh, scam scam naam same hai 1992 2003 but it's a completely different story it, it has a completely different uh, world so i think uh, pressure or comparison ka to koi nahi hai dono alag cheeze hain aur uh, hopefully but log isko bhi utna hi pasand karenge jitna pehle ko kiya did you watch the first one yes i have was there any sort of exchange with prateek gandhi i mean he became a rage after that i met him uh, at a few uh, gatherings right, here and there right. uh, and i know that he is a very good theater actor and uh, performing in theater gujarati theater and hindi theater for mm. quite some time but uh, no i did not have like a very heart to heart chat till okay. now hopefully jaldi hi mauka milega right you know since you mentioned hansal sir uh, I mean what what in what way was he really involved like on set would you say that he was involved also at a very <coughs> creative level the creative level for sure it yeah. started he started it in fact i came on a little little later stage and um, i came much later in fact uh, the script was almost done hmm. so i came because uh, he, he didn't want to shoot it i think he wanted someone else to okay. shoot the show okay. and uh, I actually called him up to for a fr- I actually called him up because I knew I I, I was actually when I saw season 1 hmm. I think I might be the biggest fan of scam one I saw it continuously <laughs> twice back wow. to back and I kept on calling him and he went mad that in fact he, in the interview also he took my name that Tushar was one of the first people to call me about right. even known but he loved the show and I believe then it's a good show and all that yeah. so when scam and because of that I started talking to him and my friend of mine told me Shad Randhawa is an actor okay, can you talk to him for some work if he can give me so I also started doing a lot of work after scam right and i called him up for that and he was in south africa i said but what are you doing your film is not starting now right i said no there's some time mm. he said okay will you do a show for me i said uh, show because my wife was also there in the room it was covid time and i said show so my wife is a producer and she thought if i do a show outside then my film uh, will get delayed even worse yeah. and she said no no you can't do a show so i said i'll call you in 5 minutes let me just call you back and uh, when he called me back again he said will you do scam and i said what scam and my wife suddenly said scam of course do do it so that's how it happened it was good karma that i got scam because of that i went to help someone and i had helped me only so that's yeah. how i got scam and after that it was just hansel sir was there always yeah he just matlab making me meet gagan he is one of like i always say that today that man is so big there's a reason that he's so big because see big, uh, people who become big is because they have this quality of giving he can give mm. the maximum even today he gives 
credit for people even more in fact rather than the actual credit he'll give you much more credit he mm. that's what he's been with me he's a guy who only gives and today if if i can become 10% like him i think i'll achieve a lot in life that's right yeah what's what's like his uh, feedback been has he seen the final of course yeah. like i said if there's not a single frame in this 2003 that 2003 scam without him what, he what knows is everything. his reaction i think he's happy that's why he's letting it come <laughs> <Yeah>. out <laughs> Uh, he called me from London few days back and yeah. uh, he told me कैसा लग रहा है बटरफ्लाइज आ रही हैं तो मैंने बोला हाँ बटरफ्लाइज आ रही हैं तो बोलता है कि आपने बहुत मेहनत की है और दो साल तक आपने बहुत काम किया है नाउ इट्स टाइम टू इन्जॉय सो जस्ट इन्जॉय द लाइम लाइट इन्जॉय एवरी थिंग लाइक ही टेक्स केयर ऑफ अर्स लाइक हिज ओन चिल्ड्रेन यू नो दैट्स हाउ ही हैज़ बीन इन्वॉल्व थ्रू आउट लाइक एवरी थिंग ही वॉच एंड ही इज देयर लाइक everything that you see it's hmm. because of his presence all around yeah. it's his legacy you have to understand scammers is legacy hai uska jaydad aajkal baap apne bete ko apna jaydad nahi deta unhone mujhe baata hai that's a very big thing true, so, true. that's why he's such a big man i say that go he's a total giver and that's how god is giving him much more and deserves much more that's right yeah uh, gagan can you tell us a bit about you know how you came on board you have been doing theater for yes. the longest time I think you were a part of an off Broadway uh, uh recently play? that was actually after scam uh, okay, okay. shoot after the scam shoot was over yeah. I I went to New York to perform Monsoon Wedding the musical yes. for uh, Meera Nair You've also worked with her in a suitable boy. Yes, I yeah. I have spot part of that. Yeah. Yes. So can you tell us a bit about you know how you came to you know be the leading face of scam 2003 मुझे लगता है कि सर ने ही हंसल सर ने ही जब मैं उनसे मिला था तो उन्होंने मुझे कहा था कि उन्होंने मेरी जो पहली फिल्म थी सोन चिड़िया विच वॉज डायरेक्टेड बाय अभिषेक चौबे उन्होंने वो फिल्म देखी थी और उनको बहुत पसंद आई थी और उन्होंने मेरे काम को नोटिस किया था वहाँ एंड देन ही सॉ अ सूटेबल बॉय टू एंड आई थिंक हालांकि सूटेबल बॉय में भी इट वॉज नॉट दैट आई वॉज शेयरिंग अ लॉट ऑफ स्क्रीन स्पेस और एनी थिंग बट आई हैड अ गुड पार्ट आई हैड अ डिसेंट पार्ट उन्होंने वो भी देखा और उनको शायद ये महसूस हुआ कि मैं अगर ये दो कैरेक्टर्स ऐसे कर सकता हूँ तो शायद मैं ये तीसरा कैरेक्टर भी कर सकता हूँ आई थिंक उन्होंने मुकेश शाबा को जी को उन्होंने कॉल किया और उन्होंने कहा कि आई वांट द ऑडिशन फॉर दिस रोल एंड देन मुकेश शाबा कॉल्ड मी के आप ही हो और आप ही को करना है सो देर इज़ नो कंटेंडर सो यू हैव टू मेक इट वर्क यू हैव टू मेक द ऑडिशन वर्क सम हाउ एंड आई वेंट फॉर द ऑडिशन आई डिड इट बट इट डिड नॉट वर्क Uh, it did not work and mukesh avda came to me and said la maza nahi aaya right. and uh, i said what do you want and he said something you need to open yourself up the, i have seen your performances in theater yeah. and i want that gagan Uh, because मैं भी बहुत कम ऑडिशन देता था और ऑडिशन देने का मेरा भी प्रोसेस ज़्यादा नहीं एक्सपीरियंस ज़्यादा नहीं था सो आई सेट गिव मी टू थ्री डेज टाइम आई विल प्रिपेयर समथिंग एंड आई विल कम एंड शो यू अगेन and then when i felt little confident about it i called him again and i said now i'm ready i, I can come for the audition uh, i performed and uh, he was not in the office at that time so his assistant was taking the audition uh, after the audition finished uh, i think he sent the video immediately to mukesh shabda right and by the time i was coming out of his office his car was coming in and he was watching my audition in the car and he rolled down the window he looked at me he spotted me coming out of his office and he said done 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 this is wow. what i wanted and i said okay okay <laughs> good uh, but i was still very nervous uh, yeah. i was walking towards home before i could reach home he called me again and he said i'm taking hansal sir on call huh. uh, so talk to him and hansal sir said very good audition gagan uh, we are on hmm. we are on for telgi and i was like wow it just happened like a filmy story you know it It's is like, it is quite cinematic so, Yeah, and since then, uh, all the procedure of uh, uh, gaining weight and and getting into the character, mm. and then talking to Hansel sir, meeting him, getting the script, so that whole journey started, and yeah. here we are today. <laughs> okay, what was both of your first reaction when you actually read up on Abdul Karim Tel Telgi? I mean, I was like, whoa. Double. Yeah, there's no material. I mean, Hansel sir told him when we met. Also, the only thing that I knew about, I knew about Telgi because you've heard about it. The entire story we knew, and we knew about what he is. But when I saw him, and I saw that when I because Hansel sir didn't make me meet him, he said, wait, wait, I'll tell you the right time to meet him. So we, we Hansel sir, I told him to put on some weight. And uh, when I met him at Hansel sir's house, and uh, I. Hansel sir realized that I'm a little disturbed because I had done a film called Sand Ki Aakhen. Right. I was criticized because I taken younger girls who didn't look Aww. like older women. So it was playing in my head, and uh, I was little panicking about that when I saw because he was even half his size now. 
what he was oh. then and uh, then i told hansa sir please let's wait let me just make sure of one thing let just give me 2 3 months because i knew a guy who could make him put on weight i knew a guy called pratik and from fit crew he made him put on weight and then we i still remember we had a photo shoot i said we have a photo shoot and a lot of applause and answers and said i will come i said no sir give me one chance let this let me just do this mm. and i did this and we sent it and you won't believe it even his nose When I used to look at him, he used to look like Gagan, but on camera, his nose used to become like Telly. It was some magic. Wow! And I sent them the picture to Hansal sir, and he just sent it to everybody across, and they said Telly has arrived. So that, so it was just that, uh, and Hansal sir told him to keep it simple. You can ask him what he told him because he just kept it. That's how he did it. Yeah, for, for me, it was uh, he. He gave me the uh, instruction to not to, you know, read any book. I I asked him that I will do research on it. I will read something. So he told me that no, you because the available material is, he sees it like a criminal because he was convicted and everything. So uh, I don't think you need to go through that path because uh, if you go through that path, then you will already make a judgment about it. True, him. true. So I didn't. I'm like it, to be Abdul Karim Telgi. I had to make sure that I believe in what I'm doing. Absolutely. Like, uh, if even if I'm sh- uh, I'm shown committing a crime or all the the, the whole scam, mm-hmm. I needed to do it with the conviction that whatever I have my own reasons to do it. Right. So That's and right. I needed to believe in those reasons, you know, which reasons came from the the way the script has been written. Yeah. So I uh, I concentrated more on the script rather than the available material. That's true. You know, it's very interesting, Agan. What you just said <laughs> that you know the other material that is available, they mostly uh, show you know sort of. portray him as a criminal so when we look up abdul karim telgi on google they say that he is a con artist the other word is a fraudster so you know as an actor as a maker i mean at the end of the day you are creating a story about somebody who is a fraudster how do you really tread that fine line where you don't glorify him but also make him very human hopefully after this first of all i hope he's called scamster <laughs> the first of all yeah. that's a hope uh that's the part where the writers come in where mm. is kiran kedar uh, karan yeah. who's written the dialogues and the screenplay and hansel sir right and the entire team had applause they make sure that uh, like i said i had already come in when the script was written they called me to direct it and execute it so they, that's where the writing part team takes care that it is authentic and it is interesting that's otherwise it turns out to be a documentary true it has true. to be interesting it has to be entertaining that's why today people even in part 1 people love the dialogues which was written by karan and now again he's written the dialogues and people will love the dialogues it's even in the teasers or trailer mm-hmm. if you see the dialogues are also spoken on one of the highlights which are there so it's we made sure that it is they they also made sure that you know hansa says this he says uh, take these dialogues and say it in a real way don't say in like a so called filmy way yeah. so it looks entertaining it looks real yeah. and then it does becomes a new that's what i think he is got that bang on right. and he made us follow that so he does the unconventional thing in a conventional way he makes it conventional yeah. that's the best part about it. even if his casting if you see made be pratik made be karishma tanna or made be harman or made yeah. be uh, made be gagan today they are the most unconventional people that you would think Very before true. before casting and then once the show comes out you can't imagine a better telgi yeah, than yeah, that yeah. right you Very can't i'm i'm sure after once you see this there can't be a better telgi than gagan over here sitting so that's that's you have yeah. to give them marks that he has that talent in him which is very few people can or oh, picking up tushar hero and then he to direct scan <laughs> is another uh, is another thing so that's all with him yeah. Yeah. Well, what's the general reception so far you have received from people in the film fraternity? Uh I think everybody has loved the trailer okay. uh, and uh, they are quite excited about it. Uh Uh, obviously, few people who who just don't get too much uh, overwhelmed by this, uh, they are saying, "Let's see. I hope uh, that the series is as good as the trailer." So, which is the right way to go about yeah. it? I think an intelligent audience knows uh, wh- what to expect and uh, how to wait and watch. So, the general hype is quite uh, uh, quite amazing. Uh, so, in any uh, message that yeah. stood out. Uh, आई मीन काफ़ी मैसेजेस हैं जो मैंने रिएक्शंस पढ़े हैं तो कुछ लोग कंपेयर करने की कोशिश कर रहे हैं कुछ लोग कंपेयर नहीं कर रहे हैं कुछ लोग कह रहे हैं कि अरे ये तो रियल लाइफ तेलगी से भी ज़्यादा तेलगी लग रहा है यू नो तो इट फील्स नाइस व्हेन यू रिसीव द लव ऑफ पीपल या यू वर लाइक आई सेड यू नो अ पार्ट ऑफ a suitable boy and there was sonchariya which is one of my favorite films of all times uh, thank you uh 
can you recall some fond memories from the sets of the film with Manoj sir, with Sushant? मनोज सर के साथ मुझे एक चीज़ याद है हम लोग वहाँ धौलपुर में थे और उनको एक दिन शूटिंग के बाद में एक बहुत दूर मंदिर जाना था किसी जो कि धौलपुर का बड़ा फेमस मंदिर है और मनोज सर ऐसे थे कि उनको लग अच्छा लगता था कि जितने लोग हैं सबको सबको साथ में लेके चलो सो ही स्पेशली अरेंज लाइक थ्री कार्स फॉर अस द पीपल हु डूइंग स्मॉलर रोल्स पीपल हु नॉट एज लाइक यू नो सबको लेके वो उस मंदिर पर गए थे और हम लोग एक घंटा पूरा जाके वापस आए थे एंड आई थिंक दैट वॉज अ वेरी काइंड जेस्चर ऑन पार्ट ऑफ इट एंड और मज़े की बात तो ये है कि आ, मेरी पहली फिल्म जो थी वो मैंने मनोज सिंह के साथ की आ, और मेरे दो तीन सीन्स थे उसमें आ, और जो ट्रेलर रिलीज़ हुआ है उसका जो नरेशन है टीज़र का आ, आ, वो मनोज वाजपेयी जी ने ही दिया है सो फॉर मी इट्स कमिंग लाइक अ फुल सर्कल I was playing Sushant's friend. Yeah. Uh, we we gelled together. We we had fun. I mean, uh, it was not like कोई one day or one incident. Yeah, the, yeah. the overall feeling was uh, quite uh, uh, chilled and Chill. you know, joke मार रहे हैं, खेल रहे हैं, थोड़ा से मजाक मस्ती कर रहे हैं, और फिर जैसे ही कैमरा शुरू होता है, हम लोग अपने अपने characters में घुस जाते हैं. Yeah, so yeah. It was all fun. It was uh, beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know tushar sometime back you just said that uh, you know the kind of backlash that the casting choices in sant ki arc received largely that sort of uh, made you very uh, you know conscious about this one that you know i would want somebody who perfectly fits the bill uh, you know looking back at whatever happened back then you know some people you know supported you some supported the other senior actors who actually spoke against it What kind of a toll did it really take on you as a filmmaker? See, I'll be very honest. Uh, no one knows it, and I kept quiet then, and I, I don't think I should keep quiet anymore because that time I was told to keep quiet. I kept quiet. So to be honest, I wanted to cast older women only. But uh, okay. when I started out, uh, I didn't get the budget. It's a very easy way to say for people on this side of the fence to say that you should have made it. Mm. I wanted to make with older women. I had my cast also with the older women, and but no one wanted to put the money in the film. So without money, the picture can't be made. एंड मुझे पिक्चर बनानी थी सो देन सम वन वन ऑफ द प्रोड्यूसर्स केम अप विद एन आइडिया दैट इफ यू टेक यंगर गर्ल्स यू विल गेट दैट इवन बिकॉज इट्स अ हीरोइन ओरिएंटेड फिल्म स्टिल आई वुड नॉट गेट द मनी दैट आई वुड वांट टू मेक दिस फिल्म फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड इट्स अ हीरोइन ओरिएंटेड फिल्म एक दो दो दादियों के बारे में इट्स नॉट योर ट्रूली कन्वेंशनल फिल्म तो टू गेट द मनी टू मेक इट आल्सो वाज अ टफ थिंग even after getting the two heroes it was tough for me to finish that movie in that certain amount of budget right. so it's not easy for a maker you know but in the end i'm happy that my my entire thing was that at the end of this that both my heroines won the best actress award so there was nothing better than that yeah. hmm. so that does justified it for me in the end okay okay yeah they won the film fair award i don't know if you know that but yeah they did yes yes yeah. okay both of them. Yeah, great then. Um, we don't have much time, but thank you so much, thank and uh, all the very best for Scam Two Thousand. Thank you so much. I'm so excited to so see how we. it unfolds. So are we? <laughs> thank Please you. Please watch it and let us know how you. Most definitely. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.